would regulate medical marijuana for the first time here in Arizona is now one major vote away from the governor's desk. It would require labs to start testing marijuana for chemicals and mold. Jeff Van Sant has the story. Medical marijuana was legalized in Arizona in 2010. Today, it's a booming industry, 158,000 cardholders and climbing. While it grows, the regulations haven't kept up. The state had no type of oversight whatsoever. That includes the chemicals used in the growing process, how it's handled. Arizona family investigators even found mold on some medical marijuana sold in Phoenix. Somebody's a cancer patient, and then they go and get their medical marijuana card, because they want to, for cancer treatment, are we making them sicker because of the stuff that's in there? Senator Sonny Borelli wants it changed. It comes in the form of Senate Bill 1420. It mandates a new testing program under the watch of the Departments of Agriculture and Health. What this bill will do is actually identify all these, chem these chemical compounds. We can't tell them no, but the patient has a right to know what's being used in it during the cultivation part of it. The bill is popular on both sides of the aisle. This affects a lot of Arizonans, uh, even Republican and Democrat. So, uh, you know, people are sick. We want to make sure that they're not poisoning themselves and making them sicker. The bill could be signed into law as early as April 20th on 420. For Arizona's family, I'm Jeff Van Sant.